Hello there, everybody. Welcome back to another anti-birth series. Today we start anti-birth eating streaks. That's right, we're on a negative one streak because I lost uh, Don Stream, I think, or something like that. What do we have? We got Mom's heels. We got we got key key curse curse key key of curse. I have no idea what that item does. To be blunt with you, uh, let's check. Let's check real quick. Sharp key allows me to consume keys and fire them at enemies, uh, and it gives me five keys off the rip. Okay, dude, I'm I'm with it more or less. I think. Um, do I really need to fire them at enemies though? That's a good question. I I think I probably do not need to fire any keys at enemies, but I suppose if if we run into a situation, just a lot, just, just freaking OBS, dude. Uh, if we run into a situation where we think that you know it it fits us best to start chucking keys at at bosses or something in a situation in which they're about to kill us or something, uh, then you know what? I'm all in. It's good to have uh, at least a little bit of a. Uh, you know, a, a backup plan, right? A safety net. Something that can can get us in a good spot uh, in a pinch. As for stats, I mean, 9 rate of fire, you can tell, uh, is really good. And, and frankly, 3.34 uh, damage is also pretty good for an Eden start. Uh, we're not going to do the item room on the first floor uh, because... Item rooms give a increased planetarium chance if you skip them. This is the only episode I'm saying it in. For the record, I know those of you that were here for the other anti-birth videos, you know how often I say it. I'm, I'm not saying it anymore. I'm just going to skip the first item room. I'm making up BS reasons for why we skip them from here on out in the Eden streak. So you better, you better not ask me or else you're going to face the wrath of the comment section. I've got, I've got the comment section on my side now. They're going to... The first person to kind yeah, I need you to actually go over there, brother, because you're going to provide me with the secret room. Look at this. He's so good at the game. Okay. Uh, more money. This makes the shop, I mean, that much more valuable now. I think I, think I will actually take a, a small trip into here. I like the bomb. Um... I think that we'll spend the... Well, I mean, look, I I think... <laughs> can't make up my freaking mind. Um, let's, let's actually take the bomb to here. And you might be like, Tyler, why, why bomb this one? Oh, we got freaking Tiny Rock, dude. Okay. I mean, that's whack, to be honest. Um, because that, that actually changes some plans now. God, I want more bombs. Uh, we, we could we could mess around with the. God, we could mess around with the uh, sack room if we wanted to. We have enough red hearts on the floor to do it too. Uh, what what was in our shop, in terms of items? Pills is is maybe actually a good good thing. Okay, there 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 is a level of min maxing that we can do on this floor to bring us to a happy spot. One of the main things that we, we want now is basically to get either, uh, you know, bomb, bomb note, curse note, bomb, bomb, curse note. It, look, <laughs> you gotta keep in mind, my brain is not fully formed, right? I'm, I'm, I'm very stupid. Uh, so the names of items, you gotta, you gotta give me, cut me some slack. I got like 550 Afterbirth Plus items, and then another like 100 Anti-Birth items, and then another like 200 modded items in Afterbirth Plus that, that are in my head. I don't remember the names of crap anymore. Um, but the one that gives you, you bombs, I'd be interested in getting. That is just like quite literally not what I asked for. Um, but that's okay. Let's, let's take a look at this. That is, that is extremely good extremely good um now you take this there there is a, there is a lot of min maxing we can do here i'm telling you um there there exists many forms of min max you don't take that yet you come here you go once you go twice you go a 
third time, and then you cry yourself to sleep at night. That that sucks. Uh, we will do it one more time here. As soon as I snag myself uh, a little a little action right here. We'll do it one more time. Um, just in the hopes it gives us basically a chest that has more bombs in it is my is my desire right now. Show me the money. You can't win them all, dude. You can't win them all. Okay, uh, that's fine. I'm gonna take this then. This room, sadly, I really wanted to get in there. Um, we need minimum two bombs to get in there, and that we're not gonna find two more bombs on this floor. So instead, we go with the next best thing, which is a lot of money and a tinted rock. Um, I mean, th this is extremely, extremely valuable for us. Super Secret Room is probably attached to your right as well, but... Um, can't do much with that. So now it raises the question of what is more valuable to me? Fanny pack or pills? I can't believe I'm actually saying it, but pills are probably more valuable. Um, but in the end, I'm going to hit you with the most valuable of all. It's a soul heart and leaving. Um, I don't think that shop's that good. And I think that, you know, if we're trying to make the most intelligent plays for an Eden streak, I think it's just better to, to save the money. Right, save the money, go down to the next floor. Um, is it down poor XL? Okay. That's actually fine. Um, just unexpected was all. This is extremely cursed. I can't believe that worked. Okay, we need, we need a damage up on this floor quite badly. Uh, I am curious. Okay, it absolutely still takes my keys, even though I got golden keys. It was worth it was worth seeing for sure, because um, we I mean we could have had a very fun time on this floor. I would love to see as much as I hate overpowered things in the game. I would love to see that item uh, synergize with golden keys. I think that would be extremely funny um, to just have infinite of this item on the floor. It's very strong though. You can tell that the damage. Uh, as that thing comes out, we can't do crap with that bomb. I normally try to like to push it to areas that could be secret room potential in things and stuff. Um, not today, sir. Not today. Uh, our secret room is actually probably to our right, though, now that I'm looking at it. But that tinted rock holds a little bit more value for us. I hope you guys are having a good one today. Uh, I'm having an okay day. Um, I've been I've been talking a little bit on on Twitter and in the YouTube community section and on Discord and stuff. I've been having some burnout issues with YouTube, and I think it's it's honestly a combination of just like world events taking a toll on me mentally uh, a little bit. And my motivation for recording has just been like extremely low as of late, and it's making me like you know when I'm in a poor mood, I hate I hate recording at least like starting new series recording. Um, because I like the first episode to be really good, right? Um, you know, ten, first episodes tend to get a little bit more traction on YouTube. I'm now trying to keep you here, enjoying my commentary. So I just, like, I, I had no motivation to start this series, um, without ensuring that, like, I was in a good mental state to do it. Hey, you wanna frig off, you little leech? Son of a gun? Okay, our secret room could also be up right here as well we need a lot of bombs i mean we're not gonna get anywhere if i don't get some bombs on this floor and frankly we're not gonna get we're not gonna get down to the next floor if i don't have bombs because i need i need two bombs just to get down to the mines which is a little bit of a problem um so we're we're actually looking for in our in our shop i'm gonna tell you right now here's what i'm looking for in the shop i would love remote detonator five bombs off the rip um makes an insanely valuable item for us uh five bombs for 15 cents is a deal that I, pretty much i will always make in isaac uh even if remote detonator itself is not that good of an item um in terms of its utility the five bombs from it is is absolutely worth the 15 cents so if we can walk in the shop and just see that right now okay good talk um if we can oh jesus dude um backpack is okay but it's not really like I'm, I'm not, I'm not indebted to this key, in the slightest. What the hell's the name of this key anyway? Just so I know, sharp key. Okay, that is now engraved in my skull forever. Uh, we'll take this, and then frankly, I'll, I'll leave. Um, I mean, this is an easy choice, but before we make it, let's check the other item room. 
and you might be like Tyler why um, it's mainly it's mainly curiosity's sake I, I probably should have just taken it um, I mean we could let these guys farm the rocks in the room for us they did hit us a little bit I honestly think that's fine um, just just keep on farming them this is one of those times where it's a level of min maxing that do we really need to do it um, probably not but why why wouldn't we right you know, it, it's a slight risk of getting hit by them. And a slight risk of getting hit by the... the Rotatey boy in the room. Spiky boy. But I'm kind of like, you know... I, I think we made a relatively smart choice there. Honestly. Okay, so two more keys. You come in here, we have Swallow Penny now, which I don't want. I can't believe you actually gave me... Um, five bombs in the shop that's... Or in the, the item room that is ridiculously good. Uh, and then Magic Mush is also going to be ridiculously good. I'm, I think we're sitting uh, really quite pretty on this one. Uh, I, I really like the direction this run is going. We had a very, very good uh, XL floor here. We cap it off with a good Devil Deal. I think that we're going to be in, in really good shape. Uh, I also think that what just happened there is totally fine. Um, eight, eight bombs now. Just gives us a lot more room to work here. Still having a 100% chance of a deal. Um, still going to explore the rest of this floor. I'm just going to go grab Magic Mush first. Um, so bing bang and a boom. Mr. Worldwide is a step in the room. That also is a full heal. Uh, keep that in mind. So we, we were able to regen all of those empty red hearts as well. Dude, does Pitbull even still exist? Or is he one of those celebrities that... I got a question for you. Okay, he does not... Gotcha. Okay, we, we're fine. My question is no longer one that I need answered. I would like it if this guy would just, like, get the hell out of my face 24-7. But I feel like there's certain uh, rappers from the early 2000s that just disappeared off the face of the earth when, like, 2010 hit. A am I the only one that feels that way? Like, have you heard a song from Ludacris in in actually 15 years? Ludacris. I'll even hit you with, like, Nelly has not made a song. I mean, let's be real. Nelly hasn't made a song since Just a Dream. But, um, <laughs> that's beside the point. I'm not hating on Nelly, okay? There might be some some big Nelly fans in the chat. I To you, I say uh, I'm pleasantly surprised that there's even Nelly fans that exist. Uh, do I have just a dream on my Spotify? Of course I do. I'm not a heathen, um, but I couldn't name another Nelly song, to be blunt. Uh, okay, give me the Tinted Rock. Thank you. All this moolah as well. Uh, if only we had a, a good synergy with all of the money right now. Got a lot of money and got freaking nothing to do with it, dude. Because the shops have been a little bit booty. I'm not going to say a lot of bit booty. But they, they've been a wee bit booty. I do think one thing I'm going to do... I'm actually going to go back to the shop. I'm going to buy a backpack. And my reasoning for buying backpack is... If we can get ourselves a, a blank card-esque item... Uh, followed by like a red key... Where we have the potential to get infinite uh, battery charges on the floor... I think that's, that's a really good scenario um and we have the the money for it right i'm gonna buy this key as well that way if we get another active item um or two active items that we really want to carry we, we can now make it work and i think that that's that's gotta hold value on this run i i refuse to believe it doesn't okay um we're probably gonna lay down a bomb on this guy uh but i'm gonna wait for him to reach this top left corner since there's a tinted rock here anyway if we can just redirect him up there take one of those i can't believe that didn't hit him but i also can't believe the small rock came out of uh the tinted rock because that is just even more damage for your boy there's the box would have been good on floor one but can't beggars can't be choosers right i don't need that hermit card come in here first in case it's a telepills you know what i will take this i'll take the flight i think that's fine 48 hour energy don't care and we go down dude Really good floor. Um, I think that the, this has set us up, I mean, just ridiculously well for a possible uh, steamrolly run that also has uh, a lot of good times. I'm going to take a sip of iced tea.
it's officially summer, dude. It's not actually officially summer, but it's officially summer in my book. Uh, and that means that the hot tea during the videos has officially converted itself to uh, iced tea in the videos. Very exciting. Okay. You gotta stay caffeinated somehow. I'm, I'm rocking this a, it's a very delicious and beautiful blackberry iced tea. Homemade. It's, it's just it's just delicious, right? I ain't drinking no no uh Snapple pile of crap with with eight thousand grams of sugar. Have you ever looked at the back of basically like any drink that you can buy in a store or in a vending machine? Do you know how much friggin' sugar you're actually eating? For a while I I it didn't really occur to me just how much sugar. Um one is in just drinks in general. Uh, this is also a conversation. I feel like Europeans are going to maybe uh, be be very confused by this conversation. Um, although then again, I don't know. You, th some drinks are, are worldwide. But like sweet tea in the US, I'm going to tell you right now, it's actually like, it's disgusting. And that's coming from someone that, that actually enjoys sweet tea. Um, there There is enough sugar in sweet tea to basically like that's your sugar intake for the the year <laughs> for what you're supposed to be intaking it's 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 disturbing and people from the south are gonna are gonna probably either go tyler's wrong sweet tea is good and it's not that sweet and i'm perfectly healthy and alive or they're gonna be like tyler's right dude it's disgusting um it's still delicious but it's it's disgusting it's just weird, um, because I find that as I get older, there's certain things that I enjoyed as a kid, due to them being sweeter, uh, that I, I, I just don't like them anymore, right? Um, one of the, one of the main ones, milk chocolate. I used to, to hate dark chocolate, uh, found it to be way too bitter. Nowadays, milk chocolate, I'm just kind of like, I mean, I'll eat it, but... I can have like one piece and then my mouth is like, you know what? Uh, how about you just never eat that for the rest of the year? Uh, whereas dark chocolate, give me like the 90% the cocoa um, BS garbage son of a gun stuff. And it's it's delicious, right? I could slam a, a thousand things of dark chocolate. I don't know what the things actually coordinates to here. A thousand things. We're talking like a thousand bars a thousand whole cocoa plants we'll never know right we'll never freaking know uh you think this is the super secret room i think it looks like it all right you know what i'll never think ever again that's what you get for thinking by the way 2020 i mean, like ridiculously good up upgrade to our run um i don't really think i needed to say it we all we all know how good it is the run's looking like it's gonna it's gonna really be a a strong one today which is good i mean that's that's a good start to uh the streak do you have a quick move my friend or can i sit right here and just kind of just kind of body you he's gonna do a brimstone beam i'm glad that he did it in a way that uh negatively affected me medallion okay um that is going to probably hit shot speed which is not that good um let, let's do this first then Krampus fight I mean this is one I I will take Krampus's head for sure um I got no reason not to we also do have uh other thing to do shot speed no nah, give us the tears up dude that's that's insanely good okay um let's just go I don't think there's anything else there's a super secret room on the floor somewhere but I'd rather save the two bombs for something of Something of legitimate value in my life. I'm, I'm not sure we're getting much value out of, uh... Out of freaking... A super secret room. They're just not that good, right? Especially in, uh, in Rebirth. Slash Anti-Birth. Super secret rooms are kinda... They're kind of le poo, poo in my opinion. The occasional black heart and such is not necessarily worth it for me to go all in on that. I'm going to do this. This is a very increased devil deal chance. And by very, I mean uh, plus 2%. Which is better than plus 1% for those keeping track. Um, but it gives us uh, more money as well. Which is fine. It's fine. Crystal Ball. I think this is where you, you absolutely go in on the idea that 
you can rock a dual dual active item scenario uh, and rock both both of these active items. I, I don't think, once again, it cramps his head. I, I normally put it in the it's too good to use situation and I end up just holding on to it for a very long time without using it. Um, but it, it's a boss clear for us, which we don't really even need because we're, we're very strong. But we, we could do like this. The thing is, I actually took damage because of Krampus' head there. Which is not good. It's not good, dude. It's a, it's a bad play by me. It, it obstructs my, my plays here. I also don't know. I don't know. Dude, this is actually going to sound terrible when I say it. I don't know how, oh, how book bag works. Does it charge both of my items? I think it does. That's actually, that's actually pretty good, dude. To charge both of those. Did it charge both? I think it charged both of those. I genuinely can't tell. Yeah, give me a second. One's at four, one's at three. They they both charge 100%. Okay, that's, that's ridiculously strong. I think that we, uh, we can feel good about how that's going to work for us. Uh, we do need to go all the way down this corridor, sadly. Because, uh... We need to snag ourselves the knife piece if we hope to do the witness on this run. And I think that this is absolutely a run uh, where the witness... I'm not going to say it's a necessity, but a first first win of the, the streak, right? And it's, and it's anti-birthy. Oh, that was just a terrible, terrible, horrendous play. Uh, first win of the streak, strong run, anti-birthy thing to do. I, uh, I, I like the idea of going for, going for the witness on this one. Hello, friends. I hate these guys. Uh, that said, hey, you want to, like, yeah, get that tinted rock from me? And then, you know what? If you can just, just, like, snag these rocks over here. Okay, we're in 99 cents. I don't need to do this anymore. Lucky Rock is, is really a very good trinket. If this run ain't proven that, uh, you could do a lot, a lot of min-maxing with a trinket like Lucky Rock. Uh, and I'm having a good time. I'm having a good time. It's quite, quite, quite good. Uh, I'm going to actually save my... I'm going to save the charge on Crystal Ball when we get it. Which is right now. Uh, I see no reason to pop it until the next floor. Right? What, why would why would we pop it? Remove the the mapping immediately. Instead, this gives us a, a good a good start to to mausoleum. We also do have the HP to get to mausoleum, which is pretty important. I suppose there is an off chance that we lose enough health in this room to have that not become a reality. But I don't know. We're we're I think we're gonna be just fine, dude. We're we're sitting pretty on this one. Disturbing and scary situation there. I also like genuinely just despise this. Come on, buddy. I mean, like seriously, you gotta come up. Thank you. You're gonna force me to come over here to to this guy. You, you, you gotta stop. You're you're being. You're being just insanely rude. Okay. Uh, latch key. I will take it. It's a, it's a soul heart, which is useful. Uh, devil deal contains Gimpy. I don't know, dude, sure. Gimpy falls under that camp of... It's fine, right? It's fine. Here, Here's this. Why is our item room... Why does our item room have an item in it? <laughs> Did I not take an item from the item room? It's this. Okay. Uh, that does make more sense. Now. Okay. Uh, we go. We go. We, we go. We go to, to mausoleum. Head down. Sip of iced tea. And you know what, dude? Let, let's, hit, let's hit you with a question of the day. Might as well get off on a, a good start. It's been, dude, it's been a little bit since we've done a question of the day. Let's let's hit it. Let's do it. We just did just did this. Oh, here's a good one. This is a good one. Uh, we'll see if they overhear me. How did your parents react when they first found out that you wanted to be a content creator? And how have they supported or hindered your career? Um, great question, to be honest with you. 
I... I, I, it's a, it's a weird question to be honest with you. Um, my, my family, I, I know that you, you say, you said parents in the question, but I'm going to include my sister in there as well. We got a planetarium. That's cool. Uh, I'm going to include my sister in there as well since it's family. But, um, when I first started making content, which was before, I mean, I, I was making content on a channel that wasn't even this channel, uh, like, you know, eight years ago or whatever it was, uh, just with a friend. I've talked about that story, uh, ad nauseum in the past. So I, I won't dwell on that too, too much. We, we made like three videos and then we deleted the channel. It wasn't that exciting of a thing, but I'm not even sure they knew I was doing that back then. And I'm not even sure for the most part they they knew even in the humble beginnings that I was doing it. Um, I have no idea what this does, dude. Is this the one that gives you a sun card after you beat the floor? Right? Where is the soul? Activates the sun tarot card and fully recharges the active item upon defeating a boss and reveals the location of the boss room on the map. Uh, it's actually a horrendous item for us. If I'm being real. Uh, because it, it doesn't actually provide us that much value. We have... We have Crystal Ball, which is kind of doing the same thing. The Sun card is at least useful, but you know, we, we have an item providing us with mapping, so it's a little bit of a an oddball one to get here. But I, I look, a planetarium room is a planetarium room. I, I am more than happy to always receive it and show off what uh, a new anti-birth item does. That is, uh, that's a tears up, probably. It's not actually. Okay, that's fine. We will we will not rock it then. Stars card, bad gas. I mean, I would actually prefer the stars card here as a teleport option. Where are we at? We're we're way past boss rush. That's fine. But anyway, I, I'm not sure my family knew I was even doing it when I first started. But obviously, like now, <laughs> they they are well aware that I do it, uh, and they're incredibly supportive of it. Which is nice. I don't remember what, what Birthright does with Eden. So I'm going to have to look at this. Um, Birthright. Where the hell is it, dude? Birthright. Different effects depending on what character you are. Eden gives a random item. But this is it gives a random item on the next run, right? No, it does it right now. So that gave me the mark. I'm, I'm not upset, to be honest. That's, that's actually quite good. Uh, let's donate a little bit. Because I, I genuinely, fantastic, it already jammed. Um, I, I really don't need all this money in the current situation. Take a note, Jeff Bezos. Okay. <laughs> but, uh, no, my family is super supportive. My, whenever, like, my mom will, will look at the, the Social Blade site that, that tracks subscriber numbers. And whenever I get close to, like, a new milestone, she'll, she'll text me, uh, be like congrats on this number yada yada um or i don't know i mean I, i've made videos with my dad before <laughs> and my sister for the record but that one might be harder to find um actually i've made videos with my entire family there's there's an overcooked video that i made with them uh intruder dead onion that's tough dude that's really tough intruder is the occasional quad shot uh dead onions piercing our shot speed is also already horrible, <laughs> which makes it a little bit tough. This is a really difficult decision. Uh, I'm going to take the anti-birth item. That That's my tiebreaker, is modded item. Intruder, for those that don't know, occasional quad shot tears, as you can see. Uh, if I get hit, the intruder comes out of my body and he starts shooting enemies on his own. Very cool item. Uh, very fun item. It is confirmed to be in Repentance. So we'll get to mess around with that one as well when Repentance releases in 2030. But, uh, yeah, I mean, my family is super supportive of what I do. Um, and, and they kind of, since I'm living at home right now, they, they help to work around my schedule a little bit with streams and things like that. Uh, so it's, it's nice. Uh, it's very nice. And I, I hate the fact that there are, there are streamers and content creators out there that, that don't have you know, that backbone of support from family for what they do. Because I know that that exists. Um, or they just straight up don't know uh, about 
and what's going on. I, I find that to be unfortunate. Uh, I, it's also understandable in a lot of situations, but... Um, yeah, I, I'm in a fortunate position, and I, I wholeheartedly understand that. There you can see the intruder popped out, and then he'll start attacking enemies and shooting at them. Uh, and my head appears to be in a little bit of a rough spot as a result of that. But thank you for your question. Uh, that was from Riku. Much love, Riku. As always, you can uh, pose questions for uh, for the, the Isaac series primarily, but uh, sometimes I answer the questions in other series as well. Um, you can pose your questions in the Discord. Link in the description. There is a video questions tab uh, that you are more than welcome to to put some questions in. I have no no reason to do that floor or that random room, dude. Getting through that room is straight up hell. Um, I'm just gonna leave. And I think that that makes my situation a hell of a lot better to just leave that room and go away. But sure, we'll, we'll continue on. What are you? Two pennies? I got 22 keys, man. I'm, I'm really not concerned about my keys right now. Which is a shame because we could have probably used the, the offensive key item. But, oh well. Uh, you suck, like, a lot, and I managed to waste Cramps' his head before you allowed me to, to hurt you. Which was a bad play by me, in the end. I'm trying to get the, the damn heart killed. I don't, I actually, dude, I, I don't know how to, how to, I don't know this guy's attacks at all. Um, which makes it a little bit difficult, for sure. Uh, that's eyedropper. Which is a tears up in one of my eyes gonna allow for some some wacky tear scenarios. Uh, we will take a bad in here as well, which is just disgustingly good. And then we'll go down. Good floor, dude. Good floor. Still have a crystal ball that we will pop. Uh, it also sh probably should have dropped the sun card when I beat that. We can also see where the boss is on this floor, but let me just hit you with this. Oh look, it's full mapping. That's why soul just kind of doesn't matter at all. Or our run. It's unfortunate. I would I would like it to matter. But kind of results in a planetarium item being a little bit of a waste for us. Just a small one, though. Just a small one. Uh, we'll take Capricorn, which is also disgusting. I mean, that's that's another another damage up. Um, a tier to lay down as well, which is useful since we're approaching the tier cap here. Uh, but it also gives us one of each consumable. The, it's just good stuff. Just keeps on getting better, right? Very, very good item. I'm happy with it. We're also max speed on this run. I am friggin' speed, brother. Happy to be in the situation that we are in where we can move uh, nice and quickly on this run. Th this, is, this will be a witness run. Uh, in case you were... At all concerned that I was going to skip it and be a little baby in the first Eden Streak video? Absolutely not. I will I will definitely go... I mean, look, we, we could just... We could just be that guy and take stopwatch, but I'm, I'm not going to be that guy. You think I'm that guy? Boy, you got, you got a lesson to learn if you think I'm that guy. If I haven't brutally annihilated one of my runs today uh, already, then what, what the hell? Life ain't worth living, right? Kill this. Thank you. Come in here. Give me this. I mean, look, you're you're gonna absolutely rage that I did not pick up that key. Um, I'll pick it up on the way back. We're at that point of the run where it's it's actually just all we gotta really do is is make it to the finish line. We don't gotta do much else, right? In fact, that that right there is not even useful. Why why does this spawn in here all the time? I must be missing something with this room, dude. Can you, like... It doesn't appear that you can, uh... <laughs> okay, that's a little wonky, for sure. Uh, I know that I've seen that spawn in this room before. So it's gotta be... There, there has to be something with that. That I just don't know about. Or something, something weird. I wonder... That doesn't make any sense. I don't know why that would spawn. If you have any idea what what that room is for and why Samson's Chains spawns in there, uh, please let me know. I'm, I'm very interested in this now. I'm also very not interested in that room right there. 
just holds zero value to my life whatsoever. This guy's just swinging along, dude. My lord. Guppy's tail is insanely good for our run. Since we got a lot of keys and now also have a uh, humbling bundle, which is going to give us even more keys. Very, very good. We got golden chests to open. People to see places to go. Bang. I suppose there is still a, a relatively off chance of us getting Guppy on this run. Um, you know, we, we basically... It involves getting Guppy's head from a golden chest and then just snagging a devil deal that has a guppy item in it which is not unheard of in the slightest now even we do have dual curse rooms on floors right now since we took more curses earlier uh that's going to possibly allow us to get a guppy item in there as well so it's still a chance i won't say it's high um probably go with like 20 percent chance to get guppy on this run at this point which is it, that's not that good of a percentage um, moving forward. It, it honestly is, is probably even smaller in the end. Yeah, you're doing that crap. We, we can easily flawless this. Fantastic. Uh, good stuff. Give me this. Give me this. And adios. Mom's heart. Bang. Kind of forgot that you, you immediately go away at the beginning. Makes our life a little bit harder. This is also the world's hardest attack to dodge. I have no idea how we did that without getting hit. Uh, life is good. Let's go, dude. It's a fast run, too, today. People are going to be concerned that I died on the very first, uh, very first freaking Eden video. No, no, no. Not today, sir. Not today. That took me right to the end. The thing is, I actually I would like to go to these curse rooms. I know that we don't want to waste the HP, but, like, we're, we're full HP, brother. We're, we're sitting just fine on this one. I can afford to do a little, do a little curse room a hunting. Thank you for the, the red chest there as well. Game, don't get poisoned. A little bit of a, a wonky room, to be fair. Okay. Double gave me nothing. Bad gas, and we don't know pheromones. Just a bunch of, bunch of gases coming out of you for that one. I will say, as much as I've enjoyed our, our book bag, Krampus' head, and uh, and crystal ball play here, it hasn't really been that good for us. Wow, dude, these two curse rooms gave the exact same thing. That is just unheard of. Uh, Yara rune. What the hell do you do with a Yara rune? I suppose you actually probably just dupe the chests here in a little bit at the end of... Uh, End of this floor coming up. Well, not end of this floor, but end of the the floor after. Get eight items. That seems like a, a very solid use for that. So you... You're actually easily the most annoying boss on this floor. Since you have some, some cage mechanics that make you a little bit of a pain in the rear. But you are, you are dead. Adios, goodbye. Uh, give me the HP, and frankly, I got no reason to stick around. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna go down. I'm just gonna go down. Adios, goodbye. There's our mapping. We got a mini boss down here. You gotta, you gotta at least look great. See, see what, see what is crack a with him. See if he holds any value. Uh, guess what? Zero value held. In fact, I need. I need more arms to not hold all the value that that guy had. Okay, we continue. These guys are actually kind of annoying enemies. Uh, I like them, but they, they can cause a little bit of a little bit of damage to you if you are not too too careful. Golden chest will open. Still looking for Guppy. Okay, okay, I see you, game. I see you. How in the hell are we gonna get the last Guppy item? It's basically this curse room or bust on this one. One of these two curse rooms, I suppose. Show me the money. No money. Yet. Maybe money in the future. We don't need rosary bead. We honestly don't need AAA battery either. Um, with the very little amount that I'm using. This, but... It's fine. Store credit's interesting. But not something we can necessarily utilize. Honestly, I, I genuinely think that... 
Liberty Cap is probably better for us at this point. Chance that uh, either damage up or tears up on the witness could be could be valuable. Show me the money. Come on, dude. There's a chance. There's a chance. Guppy? It's Goat Head instead. Son of a gun. That's actually... I mean, it's funny. For sure. The fact it gave me the item is... Is pretty good, dude. It's pretty good. Goat Head does absolutely nothing for us. You can't get a uh, devil deal on this floor without a Joker card. So, don't get too, too excited here. And a Blessed Penny, is, as good as it is, once again, we're... We're at the end of the run, dude. We don't need no blessed penny. I'm at full friggin' hearts. I do need to murder these guys, though. Come on, work with me. Hello, thank you. Good night. Goodbye, good night. Good riddance. Secret room. Which contains red hearts. Fantastic. You come in here, you year. And then you open. Bang, bang. The tough love is okay. Tiny Planet is is weird. Lazrags is okay. Biter Bite's fine. Wafer's obviously quite good. Um, we'll take this. Headless Baby. Brass Knuckles. Take that bird. I mean, look, I'm going to take Tiny Planet because I, I know my limitations in life and I'm here for, for fun experiences. Let's do it. Let's do it. So how, how do we want to go about killing the Witness here? In a fun way. I mean, I, I think this is this is it, to be honest with you. Kind of just got to let her rip and see what happens. Okay. I, I understand. I understand. This is one. You, you just you just crank it. Dude, I'm not fast enough to escape that, that brim beam. All right. Uh, fun run. It is on top of the chest. So I, I can't actually get into it. Um, <laughs> I like I can't get into the chest though. Is part of the problem. You know what? We do it again, dude. We do it again. That's fine. You think I care? I'll teleport out. I'll fight the son of a gun again. I would like to to not have that occur ever, cause that that sucks. Like, if I got screwed out of uh, finishing the. The fight, I would have been a little you know what, dude? I'm gonna just I'm just gonna take teleport in just in case. Right? Oh, it's already done. Okay. Wow, and now we're in this room in first person. That is just very strange. Thanks so much for watching. That's the beginning of the anti birth Eden streak. We're gonna have a good time over the course of this series. I know you guys are as excited about this one as I am. Thank you for all the support on the channel. Go check out other uh, content that I'm making. I only I only post a couple Isaac videos. I post a lot of other content, so you might find games that you actually enjoy. But that's going to do it. Thanks so much for watching. I'll catch you guys in the future. You have a good rest of your day. Bye-bye.